Hey, what's up guys? I'm Marcus with Epic Life Gaming. Thank you guys for coming back for another video. Today's video, I got some more raids for you guys. This time, I am doing P.E.K.K.A. and Healer raids. Six P.E.K.K.A.s, three Healers, couple Barbarians and Archers, just to fill the rest of the spots because it doesn't fill quite all the way up to 200. So here we go with our first raid. We're going after a Town Hall 7 just to try this out. I do have my heroes also available. So let's go ahead and try this out. I'm going to take out some of the free buildings. Check to make sure there is no Clan Castle troops. There is none. So what we have to do is clear out some of these uh, buildings on the outside to make sure that we can get our P.E.K.K.A.s on the inside of the building. Um, P.E.K.K.A.s, we all know if they get around the outside, they don't stop going around the outside. So we need them to break through our uh, my other units to take out all the outside buildings so that way my P.E.K.K.A.s will go on the inside. So it looks like as long as I drop my P.E.K.K.A.s right here, they will go on the inside of the base. So I go ahead and drop all my P.E.K.K.A.s right there. And I do need to take out my... Uh, out the uh, air defenses in order to drop my healers but my P.E.K.K.A.s do have a lot of health so they should be pretty darn good about uh, staying alive till they get farther into the base and my worst uh, thoughts come into play right here where it takes they go on the outside of the base so I have to hurry up drop my heroes down so that way they can take out some of these barracks so that way the P.E.K.K.A.s stop going on the outside of the base luckily it does happen there we go the P.E.K.K.A. start going inside take out that Tesla tower we all know Tesla towers do two times the damage to P.E.K.K.A.s so we gotta worry about that I'm getting ready to drop my Iron Fist ability there we go. Drop those guys so that way they go inside the inside of the base. Once my P.E.K.K.A.s get close to the air defense, I go ahead and drop my healers down because they literally take out a building in just a couple swipes, especially with six of them on the map. But this is a pretty fun raid. Not cheap. Um, I'll just say that. This is very expensive raid. So don't think I'm doing this for the loot. I'm just doing this to try it out, have some fun, see what it's like. And I am recording this on my Elgato Gaming Capturing Card. So let me know how you guys enjoy the quality of this. Full screen, full 1080p. Let me know how you guys feel about this uh, quality of the video. So I really enjoy my Elgato Gaming Capturing Card. Although I do wish I could post some more Destiny videos. I just don't think anybody that watches my Clash of Clans videos watches my Destiny videos. So I'm still doing my... Uh, you know, just purely Clash of Clans videos. And you guys just let me know if you want to see any other games. Um, I do have some FIFA that I have um, ready to upload also um, that I just need to edit and get it out there. But uh, it, it was a lot of fun, though. But there we go. We three started without even having to use any spells. But that was a Town Hall 7. Um, so I was just trying it out just to see how it would work. Here is a Town Hall 8 with a little bit more loot, almost... Uh, 400,000 in loot, so that's pretty good. So here we go. Got to find a good place to drop. I only have eight disposable troops, so I need to really decide on where I want to put these guys down. And what I need to worry about is hopefully there is no clan castle troops in his clan castle. And uh, doesn't look like I'll be able to take out that barracks. Kind of sucks. Um, really need to take out some of these troops. Doesn't look like I'll be able to take out that army camp. So I'm looking like I'm in a world of hurt. Trying to be able to get my units on the inside. So I am going to need to drop down my uh, heroes to take out some of uh, these buildings. So go ahead. Drop my archer queen. Drop my barbarian king. And let them start going on the inside of the base. Or not the inside of the base. But taking out the buildings on the outside of the base. So my P.E.K.K.A.s can go on the inside of the base. So here we go. Start dropping my P.E.K.K.A.s down. Looks like they're going to be able to go in, and hopefully they won't go on the outside, and they'll just straight go on the inside. My Barbarian King's almost down. My Archer Queen is down, so we're looking like we're running into some trouble already. But we do have three Rage Spells just in case, and I might go ahead and just drop one here pretty soon just to see uh, where these guys would go. Well, I was about to until the P.E.K.K.A.s decided to go on the outside of the base. Ah, so I got three on the inside, three on the uh, outside, which uh, isn't too bad, but definitely need those packets to hurry up and get back on the inside of the base. Um, deciding on, uh, look like they're not going to be able to go after the uh, air defenses, which kind of hurt me. 
Um, so I went ahead, dropped my clan castle troops on the right hand side to hopefully take out those air defenses because once those go down, I will be able to drop down my healers. Just need those guys to hurry up, take out that air defense. There they go, took it down. So there we go. I will be able to drop my uh, hero or my healers down. I was just checking to make sure there is no more uh, air defenses. I don't know where he had his third air defense. Kind of weird if he didn't have it at all. But we are looking like uh, we're running into a little bit of trouble with uh, the amount of buildings that we still have left. I'm just going around making sure there is no buildings left so that way I don't run into any trouble at the very end. But uh, my P.E.K.K.A.s are doing a good job. They do a lot of damage per second. So that's what's going to be able to help me get through this space because I have less than a minute and only at 80%. So right here was the perfect case scenario where I did want some of the P.E.K.K.A.s to go on the outside because I need them to take out the, the units on the outside um, or the buildings. So there we go, taking out the Barbarian King, that last air def or the Archer Tower. Well, I got one more. I don't know. It's Christmas. Hopefully you guys all had a good Christmas. I sure enjoyed mine. Probably one of the best Christmases I've had. Um, it was awesome. Got a lot of family time. So hopefully everybody else enjoyed their Christmas, got the gifts that they wanted, and maybe even got somebody else a gift that they wanted. So, it's uh, you know, Christmas isn't always about getting, you know, gifts. It's also about giving gifts. Um, charity is a very important part of everybody's life. But no charity for this guy. I had to three-star this guy's base. Sorry for a bad Christmas storm, but I had to do it to you. But all right. So now we're moving up. A little bit tougher base. Um, I believe this is a Town Hall 9 base that I'm going to be taking on. Checking to make sure that there is no Clan Castle troops. Want to be able to take out some of those uh, army camps over there, but I wasn't able to because of that Archer Queen. I just don't have enough troops to be able to uh, take out the Archer Queen. But here we go. Decide on where I want to drop my troops down. It's going to be a little difficult because I know my units are going to have to go on the outside. Um, so this is a little bit of a trouble base. Um, I don't know why I attempted to try this base. Um, just probably just for a little bit of a uh, challenge, I would guess. But here we go. Getting through with our uh, our heroes. I do have a level 2 Archer Queen now, so that's pretty cool. Whoops. Got a dead battery coming up. But uh, yes, I did upgrade my uh, Archer Queen. And look at that. I drop them all in the same area, and one Pekka wants to go in the middle. The rest are going to go on the outside. And right there, I knew this raid was over because he has so many buildings on the outside that I don't think they'll go back on the inside. Hopefully right here, maybe they will. Yes, they do. Perfect. So go ahead, drop the raid spell. don't want to drop a raid spell if they're going to go on the outside because... Uh, uh, they'll just run out of the rage spell too quickly and look at that they go ahead and go after the farther building That doesn't make any sense you idiots. Why would you go after the farther building? So I hurry up try to drop down my clan castle troop to help out and uh, Doesn't look like it's gonna help me any Does see this was just a fail rate as soon as they went on the outside. I needed them to go on the inside um, to take out uh, you know the defenses on the inside that uh, if I took down that uh, crossbow I probably would have had a chance but that crossbow just does way too much damage and that one P.E.K.K.A is doing work especially inside that rage spell but uh, he just there's just not enough health on him because uh, all the healers are paying attention to the P.E.K.K.A's on the outside right here about to go down but those two mortars took pretty much all the health out but I did get two stars I am at 58 percent which is a good thing but there's only 41 seconds left and that's just not enough time to uh, take out the rest of this base only two P.E.K.K.A.s left anyways so I don't think there's enough with only one rage spell and two P.E.K.K.A.s that's just not enough time there's even a, uh, a builder site over in the left hand corner but this is a fun raid. This I did have a lot of fun. I'm having fun doing raids again, not just base reviews. I'm going to just take a little break from base reviews. Hopefully you guys don't mind. Um, I did a video uh, Christmas Eve that all you guys said was a great video. So hopefully you guys enjoy these videos that I'm doing. Hopefully you guys realize that I also like playing the game and I was doing a little bit too much base reviews for my enjoyment to play the game. Kind of got lazy and stopped playing as much because I was only doing base reviews. But there we go. 
Let's try one more base, you guys. This should be a good challenge right here. He has plenty of buildings on the outside, and uh, he has a few crazy, you know, setup on the inside. You know, buildings everywhere. So we're going to go ahead and try this base out. It's a Town Hall 8. The Town Hall 9 was just probably a little too tough for me. I go ahead and drop all my P.E.K.K.A.s down. Um, they're going to go after that Barbarian King. And hopefully, I, if I drop my Archer Queen down here at the bottom, they'll get them to go on the inside. So there we go. we got a few of them going on the inside, which is absolutely perfect. Take out that other uh, air defense. And I will be able to drop down my healers now to get them uh, heal them back up. There we go. There, oh, there we go. Breaking on the inside of the base. Got back in. So this is perfect. One on the outside, the rest on the inside. I couldn't ask for anything more perfect than this right here. This can happen. If one goes on the outside, maybe that's what I needed to do. Maybe I just need to drop one P.E.K.K.A. to go on the outside, clear out the room, and then drop the rest of the units. I just thought about that. Um, that might have been a better way to uh, do this raid and help me a little bit in the parts where the P.E.K.K.A.s all went on the outside. Instead of dropping them all at the same time, maybe just drop one, let them take out some of the base, and then start going on the in inside of the base um, with the rest of my P.E.K.K.A.s. But we are at 55%. Two minutes to go. Let's see how these guys do. I know these guys are going to go on the outside, but uh, darn. It's not where I wanted them to go, but we still have three P.E.K.K.A.s on the inside. Clearing out the base. There's just a lot of walls. We got the air defense that's shooting down my healers right now. We only got one left, but luckily those P.E.K.K.A.s are so strong, they just break through that uh, air defense in one strike each. So we still have two healers left. One little air defense up at the top. I'm not too worried about that air defense just because uh, I got enough units to take it all out. We're at 90%. Town Hall 8 looks like it is about to fall. So there we go. This is a fun raid. Like I told you guys, I had a lot of fun doing this. The last couple of videos I've done with raids have been so much fun, and I've been just enjoying raiding again. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this. If you did, go ahead and hit that like button. It keeps my motivation up to keep making videos for you guys. If you are new here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. You're going to get daily videos, fun content, and you get to hang out with me. Thank you guys for everything you're doing for this channel. Hope you have a great day, and don't forget to stay beautiful.